Ah. Leo nimefurahia sana. At United Nation UN wameambia William Samoy Ruto. Wamemwandikia barua William Samoy Ruto, stop killing Kenyans. How ni UN wameongea? Si Raila Amolo Odinga, United Nations. You see the problem is the world can see what Ruto is doing to Kenya. He's bringing a police state. Atukimwopos kidogo, anakuletea mapolisi na na order wa Kenya wapigo marisasi. Even baba kutotokea Wednesday, alikuwa na information that angetokea hivi, kulikuwa na an order watu wapigo marisasi pale kamkunji. UN, United Nations, congratulations that you have seen this dictator called William Samoy Ruto. Ataka nseme hivi, hakuna president anaeza ingia kwa kiti. While well, we are going through the effects of COVID-19, we are going through a, a, a depression, we are going through recession as a country, hakuna kazi, biashara hazifanyi, then you introduce like a hundred taxes to those businesses. Na kila mtu, watu wa uh, industries, the, the civil servants, uh, workers, everybody wanakwambia they are wrong. But unenda unalipa some MPs wanapitisha. Then when Kenyans wanatokea na kukwambia they will not allow you to impose that taxes on them. You shoot them on the head. Ndiyo kwa sababu unajipika kifua wewe ni president. Wewe unafiki ndaira nafanya kila mtu kenya mzima atoke. Ulisikia ule mama mtoto wake wa shule ameulua emali. Alisema yu usiku walikuwa melala nja. Alafu isiku ingine mtoto waka pigori. Sasu walikuwa melala. Ndaira alikuwa mifanya watu walala nja. I'm telling you if you are supporting Ruto in Kenya. Wewe kicho wako ni mbaya. Wewe kicho wako ni mbaya. You can't see how this man is making our country. The, the, the road he's, he's, uh, he's driving our country. And in those news, watu wa Mount Kenya mungu pia wa saidi. Mina waombea sana. By next week or next month, mungu wa mefungua macho. After maandamano, Ruto alikosa mahali ingine angejibu uh, uh, raida ama kujibu wa Kenya kwa sababu ya kuandamana. Aliona ende Mount Kenya, kuenda kulonch uh, vitu za hewa. Si alianza uh, al immediately after maandamano. Uh, si angenda kajado, si angenda machakos. Si alikimbia kina dharakanithi, akaanzia huko mwisho wa Mount Kenya. Akenda kusema, oh, uh, raida ataki nifanya. Ni kazi gani ya mefanya sofa ya watu ataki afanye. This guy is taking Kenyans for fools. Ni kazi gani ya mefanya. Ni raida alifanya watu wa embu na embu. Watu wa embu na dharakanithi. Si muna kuzaga makadamia. Ni raida alipeleka makadamia from 120 to 20 bow. Si ni ujamaa ataki kuamaliza. Ni raida watu wa Mount Kenya. Ni raida alitoa kahawa yenyu from 150 to 50. Si ni ujamaa ataki kuamaliza economically. Because anajua haa watu kiuwa mariza economically, they will not be independent thika. Watakuwa watu wa kuomba omba na watakuwa na kupigia magoti anytime you want. Silewa menda nyandara wa kulonch, barabara ilikuwa imelonchua 2020 na uhuru mwegai kenyata. Ndi watu watu kane president uhuru mwegai kenyata. Ado hizi tika ayokuwa tamale gemani. Ado hito higurai hakiri. Kemani shongwa kuenda kuataku uhuru eh, na kuru. Anajua what Uhuru did to the people of Nakuru during post-election violence. Anajua Uhuru alitoa pesa zake mfuko. Anajua Uhuru alikuja personal kwa kwa wakikuyu. Wa Alafu kemani shonga siku ya alikuwa mejificha kwa butcher ya babake. Alafu hapa anakuja kutolea tu, we tu matapiko. Ati o, oh, ati Uhuru, sijua alifanya nini, aitulimukua. Isi uliokua nani, shenzi. Let me tell you people. Na waniambiwa ato Mount Kenya. Mufungue macho. Muone where this government is taking you people. Na musipofanya hivyo my friend, mutakuja kukumbuka hata hizi video one day that we used to warn you. We used to tell you, take the right road. Na msiki, let us tell this person called William Samoy Ruto. We cannot be governed against our wishes. Na watu wa Mount Kenya, don't shield this man. That's why jana amekua uh, dharakanithi, leo amekua nyana, atazunguka the whole of Mount Kenya again. Na kuna palingina tenda, toni ya mkuwe hakiri.